Sora 2 is stunning, but there's a catch. Right now, you're limited to 10 second clips that are watermarked and only available in the US and Canada. Unless you know about this. NVIDIA is one of the only official OpenAI partners with native Sora 2 integration. It changes everything. Here's what you're getting. Full length videos, no watermarks, access from any country in the world, plus Sora 2, Google's Nano Banana and VO3 all in one platform. And NVIDIA makes over 300 creative decisions for you. Editing, scripting, visuals, sound, voiceover. It's like having a million dollar production team sit in the browser tab. Let me show you exactly how this works. Step one, go to nvidia.io. You'll land on the main dashboard. Before anything else, make sure the top dropdown is set to v4.0. That's the latest version that gives you access to all the flagship models including Sora 2 and VO 3.1. Right at the top, you'll see a prompt box. This is where you tell NVIDIA what to make. Let me show you with a real example. Let's say I want to generate something fun and cinematic, like a city scene. I'm going to type, create a 30 second cinematic short of New York overrun by mallard ducks. Click generate my video. In video, we'll process your prompt first. You'll see a short thinking screen with the title it generated and a couple of lines about your video. That's normal. It's mapping your idea to a project. Once that's done, it automatically takes you to the settings panel where you pick duration, platform, and media quality. First, duration. You can choose 30 seconds, one minute, or two minutes. I'm going to select 30 seconds. Next platform. You've got Instagram Reels, TikTok, or YouTube. Each one adjusts the aspect ratio and pacing automatically. I'll choose YouTube for this demo. It gives you the widest canvas. Now here's the critical part, media. This is where you choose the quality level. You've got three options, basic, pro, or ultra. If you leave it on basic, NVIDIA will pull from stock footage and generated images, totally fine for quick drafts. But if you want the absolute best quality, you need to select ultra. That's what unlocks the flagship AI models like Sora 2 and VO 3.1. Ultra means fully AI generated video, not stock clips cobbled together. That's the difference between good and stunning. I'm selecting ultra. One more thing. See that option to attach reference images? I'll add a couple of reference images here so NVIDIA can match the exact style I want. Lighting, colors, composition, all of it. Just drag and drop. Now I hit generate. Watch what happens. NVIDIA starts building the video in real time. You can see the progress bar moving. It's analyzing the prompt, selecting the best model for the job, generating shots from scratch, matching the style, layering in music, adding voiceover if you specified it. When it's done, you've got a full video already cut, scored, and styled. And look at this, the lighting is dialed in, the pacing is smooth, the transitions are professional, the visuals are stunning. Because we chose media, ultra, this isn't random stock footage. This is AI generated content that looks like it was shot by a professional crew with a six figure budget. Let's test this with a couple of more examples to show you the range. First. I want to try something with people in it, because that's where AI video used to fall apart. Bad facial expressions, weird movements, uncanny valley stuff. Let's see if NVIDIA plus Sora 2 Pro can handle it. I'm going back to the prompt box and typing a humorous 30 second cinematic ad where a blue retro compact car is hilariously stress tested. Platform, YouTube, duration 30 seconds, media, Ultra. I'll also drop in a couple of reference images here so NVIDIA knows exactly what vibe I'm going for. Hit generate. At Drio, we take testing seriously. Sometimes too seriously. Watch this, NVIDIA picked a solid scenario, the visuals look realistic, the faces are clean and believable, and the overall production quality is exactly what you'd expect from a professional ad. The pacing works, the shots flow naturally, 
and nothing feels off or awkward. This is the kind of video that would have required a full crew, location permits, and multiple shooting days, and we just generated it in under two minutes. Now let's flip the format. Most content today isn't horizontal, it's vertical. Instagram Reels, TikTok, YouTube Shorts. So let's test that. I'm switching to a completely different vibe. A 30 second stylish vertical fashion video, a model walking through neon lit Tokyo streets at night, cyberpunk aesthetic. This time, platform, Instagram Reels, duration 30 seconds, media, ultra, generate. Look at this. In the electric heart of Tokyo, where neon dreams come alive, style isn't just what you wear, it's how you own the night. The aspect ratio is portrait, the framing is tight and cinematic, the neon reflections are dialed in, and the pacing is fast. Exactly what you'd expect from a high-end reel. The model's walk cycle is natural, the lighting shifts as she moves past signs, and the whole thing feels like it was shot on location in Shibuya with a $50,000 camera rig. We didn't shoot anything. We didn't hire anyone. We typed two sentences. This is what I mean by flexibility. You can go from a cinematic Mallard duck invasion to a retro car ad to a cyberpunk fashion piece, all in different formats, all in minutes, and every single one of them looks professional, polished, and ready to publish. No editing skills required, no shooting, no stock footage hunting, no spending hours in Premiere Pro or Final Cut. You describe what you want, choose your settings, and then video builds it. This is what makes it a game changer. Now here's where it gets wild. Let's say you've generated a video, but you want to tweak something. Maybe the lighting isn't quite right. Maybe you want different music. Maybe you want to change the pacing. Normally you'd have to open an editing suite, scrub through the timeline, adjust layers, export, and hope it looks right. Not here. First, click edit and download. This takes you into the editing interface. You'll see your video playing in the preview window and right below it, there's a text field that says, give me a command to edit the video. That's where the magic happens. Let's say I want to change the music. I type, make the music more upbeat and energetic, then hit the blue arrow button. In video, rebuilds the video with a new soundtrack, Done. I want a different opening shot. I type. Replace the first clip with an aerial shot of Times Square covered in ducks. Hit of the arrow. In video swaps it out. And you're not limited to text commands. See that edit button at the bottom? Click it and you get a drop down. Media, music, script, settings. You can dive into any of those sections and make manual tweaks, change clips, adjust voiceover, swap music tracks, or fine tune the pacing. If you don't like the result, just type a new command or go back into edit media or music or script and adjust it again. No regenerate button. You just keep refining until it's perfect. And when you're happy, hit download right there on the same screen. You can also use the like dislike buttons or click add feedback under the player. This helps the AI learn what you prefer, but it's optional. This is what I mean by text-based editing. You're not dragging clips on a timeline. You're just describing what you want and in video does the rest. Now, if you don't need a full edited video with music and voiceover, if you just want standalone video clips that you can edit yourself, go to the agents and models tab and open the generative models block. This is where you choose which AI engine powers your video. Here you'll find the key video models. VO 3.1, VO 3.1 Fast, Sword 2 Pro, Sword 2, and VO 3. Each one has its own strengths, and you can switch between them depending on what you need. Let me show you. I'll select Sword 2 Pro. This is the most realistic video model with audio built in. I type a prompt. A golden retriever running through a sunlit forest, slow motion, cinematic lighting. Hit generate. Watch this. The lighting is natural, the motion is smooth, the dog's fur moves with the wind. This is photorealism. Now let's try the same thing with VO 3.1 fast. Same prompt. Hit generate. See the difference? VO is faster, noticeably faster, and it gives you a result that works great when you need to produce a lot of content on a tight timeline. The result is still high quality, but the style is slightly more stylized and it prioritizes speed over hyperrealism. If you're producing content at scale or working on a tight deadline, VO 3.1 Fast is your go-to. 
want something more narrative driven? Try VO3. It's designed for storytelling. Longer clips, better continuity, more cinematic pacing. And here's something important. Videos generated with Sora 2, Sora 2 Pro, or VO come without watermarks, and you can use them commercially. Full rights, no strings attached. Now let's talk about Nano Banana. This is Google's image generation and editing model, not for video, but for static visuals. You can use it to create thumbnails, preview frames, or any still image that matches the style of your video. Let me test it. I type a minimalist tech workspace with a laptop, coffee cup, and soft natural light. Hit generate clean, professional, usable for a video thumbnail or a blog header. Nano Banana is fast, accurate, and perfect for visual assets. One more thing, scroll down in this section and you'll see other models. WAN 2.5, Kling 2.5, Pixverse 5, and more. You can experiment with these for specific tasks or styles. NVIDIA gives you the full toolkit. So here's the takeaway. You have options based on your needs. Photorealism, Sora 2 Pro, Speed and cost efficiency, VO 3.1 fast, narrative driven storytelling, VO 3, and for static visuals like thumbnails or preview frames, Nano Banana. This is flexibility at scale. If you're a YouTube creator, this is a no brainer. You need B-roll for your talking head videos, generate it. You want a cinematic intro, type a prompt, explainer videos, tutorials, product reviews, and video handles, all of it. Instead of spending hours searching stock footage or filming filler shots, you're generating exactly what you need in minutes. Let me show you what I mean. Say you're a travel creator and you need a one minute teaser that actually stands out. Not just beaches and generic drone shots. Normally you'd either buy a stock montage, hire an editor who knows cinematic travel, or just post something simple. Here's what we're doing instead. I'm typing, create a minute long travel video teaser, which highlights lesser visited cultural villages like the Himba tribe of Namibia or the Maasai of Kenya. Use drone shots to capture vast African landscapes and intimate close-ups of village life, clothing, and rituals. Make it cinematic. Platform, YouTube, duration 60 seconds, media, ultra, generate. And there it is, rich, atmospheric, like you actually flew to Africa with a crew. You've got a custom teaser that looks like a paid documentary opener. Took us a minute. Now imagine doing this for B-roll, transitions, cultural spotlights, storytelling inserts, every piece of video you need on demand without digging through stock and without waiting for a freelancer. You're not just saving time, you're creating at a level most travel creators can't reach because they're still stitching together whatever footage they have. If you're in marketing, or social media, this is your content factory. Product demos, ad creatives, Instagram reels, TikTok hooks. You can spin up dozens of variations in an afternoon. Test different angles, different music, different visuals. See what converts. One prompt, five outputs, pick the winner. Let me show you. You're a social media manager and your client needs a short promo video for their gym. It has to feel powerful, modern, and premium, not like a generic stock fitness ad. Normally, you'd plan a shoot, find athletes, book a location, maybe rent lights. Let's generate it instead. Prompt. A 30 second horizontal video for a bold, modern fitness brand built around strength, precision, and performance. Designed for athletes, lifters, and everyday warriors. Dark, cinematic look, futuristic energy, close ups of muscles working, metal equipment, dramatic lighting, inspire people to push limits and stay focused. Platform, YouTube, aspect ratio 16.9, duration 30 seconds. Generate. When your body screams, stop. When your mind begs, quit. Repex warriors whisper the same sacred words. One more rep. Because greatness isn't built in comfort zones. There it is. Looks like a high-end sports brand spot. Send it to the client, they love it. Now generate three more variations. One with more athletes, one with cooler lighting, one that's more cinematic, and let them pick. You just delivered a full content package in the time it used to take you to brief a production team. And if you're running an agency or working as a freelancer, charging clients $2,000 to $5,000 per video, NVIDIA just became your secret weapon. Rapid prototyping, client previews, mood boards, you can show three different creative directions in the time it used to take to brief a videographer. Here's how it plays out. 
a client comes to you and says, we're launching a Mexican food brand. We need a 30 second spot, warm, festive, cinematic. So the food actually looks irresistible. Normally you'd pitch a concept, wait for approval, book a studio, a food stylist, lights, a crew, and then wait for edits. Now you do it live. Prompt. Cinematic 30 second commercial for a Mexican restaurant, warm rustic tones, close ups of nachos with salsa and melted cheese, macro crunch shots, lifestyle, friends at a fiesta table, Mexican decor, musicians in the background, lively Mexican jazz, smooth dolly pan moves, and with a hero shot of the logo under warm light. Platform, YouTube. Duration 30 seconds, generate. You show it to the client right in the pitch. They love it, but want a version with more people at the table or longer food close-ups. You tweak the prompt, regenerate, done. You just turned a two week approval cycle into a 20 minute live session. The client's happy because they saw the exact vibe before spending money. You're profitable because you didn't burn hours on spec work. And if you're an e-commerce brand or dropshipper, you need product videos at scale. In video plus Sora 2 Pro equals product demos that look like they cost $10,000, but took you 10 minutes. Here's how it works. You're selling a premium luxury watch. You need a hero video for your landing page, Instagram or Facebook ads, maybe a brand presentation. It has to be cinematic, detailed, with macro shots of the mechanism. Hiring a product studio for that, expensive and slow. We just generate it. Prompt. Create a hyper-realistic video commercial of a premium luxury watch. Make it cinematic. Use close-up of the watch and its parts. Use American female voice for English narration. Platform, YouTube, duration 30 seconds. Generate. Done. You get a cinematic spot with macro shots of the case, bezel, strap, light playing on metal, plus an American female voiceover. Drop it on the landing page, run it as an ad, plug it into your email sequence. Cost, your subscription. Time, minutes. Bottom line, you can now create ad films, social content, cinematic videos that look like they cost six figures without knowing how to shoot or edit. You're not limited by geography, by watermarks, or by short formats. Whether you're a solo creator launching a product, a marketer building ads, or an agency pitching concepts to clients, in video with Sora 2 gives you capabilities that were impossible just a few months ago. And because it's an official OpenAI partnership, you're not worried about access being pulled or quality dropping. This is the real thing. You can try in video for free, but I recommend the generative plan at $100 a month. That's the one I use. Gives you enough credits to make multiple videos and full access to Sword 2's capabilities. Links below. Let me know what you create.